20 laps the distance. Dick Brack will set the pace. And Frank Gastonal, Frankenstein flanks outside. Row number one here for the IMCA Modifieds. We'll work out a corner number four. We'll turn the Modifieds loose here at I-76 Speedway. Everybody will clear corners one and two. Dick Brack with the race lead. We'll work down the back straight away. Here comes Brian Cross. Cross to the inside in that second spot. Whole bunch of cars bottled up there about mid-pack. Joe Mullins working on the 13 car battle for the race lead. Cross had a look underneath Dick Brack. Dick Brack able to hold him off as they work down in the corners. One and two. Brack on the high side of the racetrack. Cross down low. Good run by Dick Brack out of corner number two. Clean racetrack in front of our top two drivers. Brack now way up high. Leaves that door open for Brian Cross on the low side of the racetrack. Here they come down the front straightaway. Brack again to the outside. Cross on the inside. Cross hooking up that low line of the racetrack. Momentum being carried by that 2.0 at Dick Brack. Here comes Joe Mullins now. He's creeping up into the mix side by side for the race lead. Watch him out of corner number four. At the line, Dick Brack able to hold him off. Again into corners of one and two. Brack on the high side, cross down low. Much closer this time down the back straight away. Joe Mullins is closing in a hurry on our top two drivers. They battle side by side. Joe Mullins now has thrown his hat in the mix as he's working the high side back behind. Dick Brack, three car battle now for that top spot. Brack and Mullins on the high side of the racetrack. Brian Cross committed that low side. Cross side by side, inches ahead of Dick Brack. This time by new race leader at the line, Brian Cross, contact. Cross wasn't quite clear. Dick Brack slid right in the left front of Dick Brack's ride. John Hansen has moved into the fifth spot. He'll go to work on Craig Gustus down the back straight away. Hansen has found that upper groove as well. Fighting on the inside is Craig Gustus. Gustus will give that spot up to Hansen. Bernier now into the sixth spot. Has finally gotten by some of the cars he was stuck behind. Cross leads, Mullins second. Cross gonna have a battle now as they work out on corner number two. Mullins will drive it in deep on the outside lane. How about John Hansen now switches it back to the bottom side of the racetrack. Here comes a charging Hansen in the 8H. Hansen scored third, working to go by the 2.0 of Dick Brack, side by side for the race lead out of corner number two. Joe Mullins will inch ahead of Brian Cross down the back straight away. Mullins works that high line of the racetrack, try to get by Brian Cross at the line. New race leader, Joe Mullins. Cross could, couldn't hold him off any longer. Caution flag is out as Frank Gaston all around in corner number four. Mullins, Cross, Hanson, your top three. Mullins will start us up high, bring us out low out of corner number four, back underway. Hanson the outside of Cross, makes easy work of the 78 car. Here comes the charging Hanson. Justice has gone by for that four spot. Jeremy Fernier now in the top five. He's got by Dick Brack for that fifth spot. Mullins out front. Hanson second. Cross has settled into that third spot. Cross now feeling pressure from that 14 of Greg Gustus. See if Hanson can run down our race leader, Joel Mullins, both using that high line of the racetrack. Caution flag is out. Mullins will start us quick out of corner number four, back to the green flag. And caution flag out once again.
Mullins, Hanson, Cross, your top three, about to fire him back off out of corner number four, this time by Joe Mullins, back to the line. Cross underneath Hanson for that second spot. Gustus, here comes Jeremy Frenier. He's now up in the mix in that fifth spot. Joe Mullis continues to lead. Cross now scored second as he's gone by John Hanson at the line. Hanson fights back, drives into deep on that outside lane, trying to get by for that second spot. Cross still scored second at the line. Mullins continues to lead on the high side of the racetrack. Still side by side, Hanson and Cross. Mullins continues to lead battle for that fourth spot. Greg Gustus in spot number four. Jeremy Frenier lurking on that high side. Hanson now clears Brian Cross, able to go back by the 78 car. Gustus on the way, bottom of the racetrack. Allows Frenier to pull up alongside the 14 car. Battle for the fourth spot. Jeremy Frenier side by side with Gustus. Frenier will go by Gustus on the outside lane at the line. Gustus actually still scored fourth. Jeremy Frenier is coming, gonna get two cars in the first set of corners, a two for one deal down in corners one and two. Will now set his sights on John Hansen now into that third spot. Frenier's car has come to life in the late stage of this modified feature. Unfortunately, the laps are winding down. White flag is out one more time around for Joe Mullins. Mullins on the high side of the racetrack. One final time down the back straightaway. Long time since we've seen Joe Mullins in victory lane. He'll set us up the final set of corners. Out of corner number four, Joe Mullins gonna grab the checkered flag here tonight for your IMCA Modifieds. John Hansen second, and Jeremy Frenier will round out your top three. Fourth goes to Greg Gustus, rounding out your top five will be the 78 of Brian Cross.